Week three, workout four, pull. One of the first core moves that she does that we can modify pregnancy-wise is laying on her back with a ball between her knees and a weight right here. And she goes side to side. I just took the weight. I took a little bit heavier weight and I went to standing. And I did some rotations. To get that same rotation with less of the internal core working. Really just working the abs, the back, some legs, and get your heart rate up too. Second move to be modified, she puts the ball between her legs and does a lap fall back with a sit up. So it would look like this here, and then she would do a sit up instead for pregnant mamas. And even postpartum, we're gonna go back here, and then you can either do a hip bridge, squeezing that ball, really working the glutes, or postpartum mom is another great one to work. If you have a little diastasis recti, down, up, tap, and up. Really keeping that back pressed down into the floor. Third core move is a leg lift with ball. If you're postpartum and can't do a full straight leg, Leg lift, you can bring it here and just do some taps. Prenatal mamas, pregnancy. I didn't even worry about the leg lifts. I just took it here, side plank. Half the time that she's doing leg lift and then flip to the other side, the other half. You don't, don't even have to use the ball here. Just working on, the, working on the side body. Fourth move is a sit up with the ball. So she puts the ball behind her, takes it back, does a bicep curl and then comes back up. For us, we're gonna do standing, keep the bicep curl, and you could even take a single leg here, boom, switch, so that you're getting that nice, strong back, keeping that core up, or keeping the leg up with the core, and still getting the biceps. Next move is a decline sit up. So she comes all the way back, brings it all the way up. We're gonna take this to standing, do a little something different. We're gonna go ball up in the air here, and then we're gonna do a nice wide squat, leg lift. Squat, I'm taking the ball and I'm really pressing that ball together as well to get a little shoulder work. You can bring it down in between, boom. Up, boom, up, so that you're still getting great core work. You're even gonna have a little cardio spike, some shoulder in there, but you're keeping the spine nice and straight and you're not doing the crunching. 